It is the end of an era for a Seattle business after being open for decades in Belltown. Tonight, the final chapter for comic book shop Xanadu. King 5's Amy Marino has more on why customers and employees say the city is losing something special. It's over 42 years. We've been in this location for 25. It's more than just a shop. A community gathering place. The racks are filled with so many stories, but the best ones might not be under these bright covers. This is just a good place where you can come, man, and you don't find too much of what's going on in the world. It's a place to come and escape. You know? Really, the heart and soul of this small shop is the people. <laughs> Friends that owner Perry Plush will say goodbye to as they shut down for good. That's what I miss. I'm going to miss the most and stuff. Uh, is the is the people. See, if you think there's characters in comics, you should see my friends and my customers. Perry's embraced the cast of characters, transforming them into family. My whole life I grew up uh, in comic book store and uh, you know I learned how to read on black and white turtles comics. Characters uh, like Casey Sylvia. You, know, you can be 60, come in here, have not read comics in 20 years, and it's like boom, you're a kid again. You know, you remember how it felt to like get a comic off the spinner rack. Casey showed up 11 years ago and they gave him a job. With support from the shop, he launched his own comic book. You know, it's just sad because places like this are really what make the city. The reasons for closing are the ones we've heard before. A drop in sales, a tough business climate in Seattle. Customers can't afford to live in the city. All the usual things, but it's clear nothing was business as usual if here. If it wasn't for Perry, uh, I wouldn't be able to really survive living in this city. He's helped me out so much, like, you know, being kind of a surrogate father. Um, he, you know, we don't get paid a lot, but he helps you when you need. And being here and having this place is, it was a dream, you know? And it's really, uh, it's really sad that it will be here anymore. I haven't cried yet. I've cried. On this last night, there are tears and happy memories too. I got my engagement photos here uh, taken inside, right over here. Perry plans to keep selling comics online. It's not ending, it's just a new adventure. They normally lock the doors at five, but tonight everyone lingers buying a few more books, even the posters on the wall. Might as well go ahead and take this on home with me, man. The cool thing about this is I'm buying stuff to take a piece of Xanadu with me. They'll all take a little bit of Xanadu with them. They say there's comic book ink running through their blood, and they can't help but find inspiration from the stories that brought them together. We've been eclipsed right now by the, the evil or whatever, but you know, it's comic books, they, ne they never end. You know, the story is never, never over. People will, you know, take what they've learned here, what they found here, and hopefully pass it on and hopefully continue elsewhere. So, thank you so much, I appreciate it. Amy Marino, King 5 News. Oh, that was hard to lose those gems of the city Aww. where the cast of characters hang out. So.